This is my experience in Italy. This is a true story from when I played over there. We're beating Montalieri, apparently a team that my team had not beaten in 17 years. We're beating them in Montalieri. We're beating them two games to none, and we're up 13-5 in the third. And at 13-5, my, my, uh, my middle blocker, Massimo Rofaldi, goes back and serves the ball right into the middle of it. We side out, and the side out's going right there. And at 13-5, Paolo, Paolo Rossi, my set, he goes back and serves the ball right into the middle of the net. We side out again. And I get back here and get ready to serve. Now, we're, you know, there's about 2,000 people. They're very mad because we're two points away from beating them for the first time in 17 years. They're, they're spitting and they're throwing the coins. They're doing the, you know, they like they don't want to lose stuff. And I get ready to serve, and my coach says what? He says, he says, non bate la pala nella rete. And I go, va bene, Hugo. And I go like this. <laughs> I hit it as hard as I could in the crowd behind me. <laughs> Three ball system. We got another ball. They set me a pipe. We got 14. They set me a red or whatever we called it back then. Because everything's different in you know, the other countries. And I killed it. We won. They left on me. The fans rip off the... Uh, the, the arms on the things that are coming down to the bench. <laughs> We take off. We take off in the locker room. We're in the locker room. They overturn our bus. You know, yeah. they, and in the locker room, my coach says, "K cut so five," which means, "What the f did you do?" And I said, "I don't speak great Italian, but I think you said don't serve in the net." He says, "That's exactly what I said." You know, the fingers too. That's exactly what I said. <laughs> and I said, "I didn't." <laughs> I said, Massimo, Paolo, tell Ugo, when you say don't serve the net, tell him what you're thinking. And they all are going, oh man, you don't want to do this. <laughs> I said, tell him, tell him what you're thinking. Just tell him what your head says. And they look at him and go, serving you in the net. You can't teach a negative. You have to tell me what you want. I said, Ugo, if you had said, Paolo and Massimo, those dumb bastards, they, they couldn't even serve a ball with a net. Put yours in, for God's sakes. I would have gone, over and in, got it. And I would have served over and in. But you said, don't serve in the net. What are you thinking about? Mm -hmm. Serving in the net. That isn't coaching. And so we had a bottle of wine and we talked about it for many days. And he became a better, positive coach. Because that moment helped him understand that when you try to teach a negative, you can't teach a negative. Everything is heard as positive. If I said, don't think about pink elephants, you know, the question is, does it have party hats or is it dancing? <laughs> but everybody goes, I've got a pink elephant. You know? 